also I wanted to thank Mark and Jennifer for um, holding another wonderful convention for us. And I also wanted to thank all the convention staff, all the volunteers who helped put this uh, marvelous event together. Guys come out really quick and introduce themselves and what they do. So, hello everybody. Um, my name is Dimitri, and I'm a designer for Huddles. I work on Hot Wheels, RLC, and Monster Jam. Hi everybody, my name is Mike Yeh. I'm in marketing for Team and Premium. Hi Alright, so, who wants to see some new cars? Okay, you guys have to cheer when you guys like a car. So we know what you guys like, so we can continue building these cars. Okay. All right. Okay. So I'm gonna have Dima kick off our basic cars. Dima, take it away. <laughs> well, uh, let's see what we got here, guys. How's my accent? Can you guys understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Cool. Well, the accent I got is for ladies, uh, but you know. Um, okay. So let's go. So one of the models for 2017 is 16 Cadillac ATS VR. And as you guys know, as everybody knows probably, this is the very significant car for Cadillac racing because of its first uh, V6 with uh, three turbos. So um, we really get very well authentic uh, deco and I think it looks awesome. What do you guys think? Either boom or you know, you guys can cheer. So. The next one is. Well. Hold on. So, Jimmy has done a lot of prep work. He basically came up, we all together come up with a very you know, new uh, mini collection. It's called What If. Um, the whole team worked really hard on this one. What do you guys think? Well, this actually jokes, so I apologize, you know, but that, that's, that's just uh, one for fun. But you guys like it, so I guess we have to make it. <laughs> no, this is not a real one, we just did something for fun to break up the, you know, love out of you. But I guess you guys like it, right? Yeah. Totally, so we're making it for 2019. Deal. Uh, thank you, Jimmy. What, what about new mini collection? What if? Yeah! Exactly, anything goes. So, um, well, that was actually a Russian car I heard, yes, yes. I'm Ukrainian, by the way, so. Well, another one is 16 Mercedes AMG GT3. Uh, this one is not all, it, this is part of Legends of Speed Mini Collection. Uh, very authentic. Uh, we just uh, renewed our uh, partnership with Mercedes, so this is very significant. Great casting by EU. And uh, this one is also part of uh, Project Cars. Uh, so, so, yeah, it's basically a partnership with Project Cars. As you guys know, it's, it's a new uh, video game, um, very popular. And this one is one of the cars that's uh, featured in, in Project Cars. This is Jeep Wrangler, heavily fixed by Phil. We need to make sure that Phil, Phil, Phil knows that you guys love it because uh, he's a Jeep owner and he went out all out on this one. Um, I guess the next thing for him to do is take his Jeep and turn it exactly the same thing. Because his Jeep, you know, doesn't look as good as this one. It still has stuck wheels. I can tell you that. I can tell you that. Yes, yes. And he does, he drives Prius. Can you imagine this? 
Ryu is the best guy to make something like this. This is actually his baby. And it's, uh, I think it's awesome. You guys probably have seen it. This is Rideko, and I think this one's going to be great. This is probably one of the coolest wins you know, you know, toys that we've ever used. Well, you know, I can say when you guys refer to Honda, we refer to uh, the Nisimoto Hot Wheels. You know, it's one. So in this case, it's it's a Civic Type R, uh, and uh, we just partnered up with Nisimoto. He's a, uh, a nice gentleman and also a new uh, powerhouse in, in the world of turbocharging vehicles, domestic, and well, he's known for uh, 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 Japanese cars mostly, but now he's turning into the domestic market. And so you will see quite a few interesting projects coming from here. And he does build a, a number of cars to see on and this year also. So he's a great partner of ours, and this is to commemorate the partnership. This is 2016 Honda Civic Type R. Well, yes, I know. We have to, you know, we have, we, we sold in multiple markets. So to keep our Bavarian friends happy, this is BMW M2. Uh, I think it's a great casting and it's part of the factory fresh. So we try to keep it clean just as the way it left the showroom. Yeah. 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 Can anyone tell me what's special about this one? Raise your hand! Really? Super hunt! I got it, you got it. I just did it. Yes, it's a, it's a super treasure hunt and. Uh, can you go wrong with Camaro? No. Is there a Camaro or is this a Camaro or the Ford crowd? Chevy or Ford? Sounds like Honda because I can could barely hear people screaming. Yeah. No, because it's a Chevy yeah, 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 no, I can hear you guys. Yes, Prius is the loudest one, yes, true. Oh, this gets a tough crowd today. Okay, so now I'm going to give it to somebody else. Thank you guys, you've been great. Thank you. What's Kmore? Kmore! There are some Kmore. And these are some upcoming promo cars that we have. Uh, so the Walmart uh, they have is the Chevy Blazer. And of course, the 55. These are four Kmores. Okay. You know we do. Are, we are selling cars at Central Eleven. I don't know if you guys have been doing that. <laughs> All right. So for 2018, we have 18 different theme assortments. This is just one of them, and it's a. Uh, Theme assortment dedicated to all the Chevy trucks. It's our 100th anniversary, so we have our 52 Chevy, and this is a Walmart exclusive. No one likes it. And we also have a 67 Chevy C10. So this will be an eight-car assortment. Um, I'm only showing two because it's always good to have some mystery. I want that seat right now, please. It will be. Yeah. All right. Okay, so I'm going to move on to pop culture. So in 2018, we'll have five different assortments for pop culture. Uh, five different mixes, I'm sorry. And the first one up that will come out in Dodge Calendar. Charger. Mopar. What? I can't. I can't really hear you, but... Drive okay. us! <laughs> Alright, so the first one we have, Nestle. And this is the Budfinger Plymouth Satellites. Casting that we've seen in a while. And we also have Crunch Car, which is the Ford Fairmont. Alright. So, the second mix my favorites. We've recently teamed up with uh, 
Alex Ross, who's a prolific comic book artist, and he's known for like his hyper-realism art. And so we'll have a whole mix of his art, uh, and this one with the custom Dodge van with Batman on it. Enjoy! <laughs> I was in art school, Alex Ross was my inspiration. Uh, he's one of the greatest illustrators uh, of our time, especially for comic book art. Uh, so it was a real honor and pleasure to actually design this packaging and get to use his artwork. And I think you guys would be really impressed with, uh, with this mix. All right, so we also have the Dodge Able to win. Al Jordan on there. And an Austin Mini Man of the Motor Woman. Alright, car culture. Who wants to see some car culture? So, coming up very soon is our Cars and Donuts mix. And this is a new tool that we have. It's a BMW M1 Pro car with a really sweet BMW M livery on it. And, Julian, you want to chime in on the packaging really quick? So this is Cars and Donuts. It's supposed to be like Cars and Coffee. So the idea was to create sort of the experience of getting up early in the morning, and going out and checking out all these cool different cars, exotics, and muscle cars and everything. Uh, one of the things you'll notice as we cycle through is that we actually switched out the cars in the background on every card as a new one rolls up in front. A different one rolls out to the back, so there's that detail. And then for some strange reason, there's a Copa Camaro in the background that they are not needed in its own way. All right. And it's the return of the Alpha. Alpha Romeo Springy Julia Spring GTA. And we also have the Fogu Z. It's first execution. Because this is our 2017 car culture line. Now you guys seen Redliners, I've shown you everything now. What's nice, so there was five mixes here, but then I have a bunch of question marks right here. And if you guys were in the autograph rooms earlier today, you might have saw a special treat or a special box set that we had. Yeah. And that is our sixth mix, essentially. And the cool thing about that is, literally, each one of those cars is the sixth car of each of these uh, previous mixes. So you're going to get one car from Redliners, you're going to get an extra car from Aerocool, you're going to get an extra car from Race Day, Modern Classics, and Cars and Donuts. And I will show you them in case you guys missed it earlier. So first, we have the Mercury Comet Cycle. And the amazing thing is the packaging matches all of the uh, original Redliners. Next, yeah. someone mentioned that Gulf Camaro in the background, and here it is for you. Oh. 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 With the new nice red ring, and it's on the board if you guys want to see it. And also, we have an 84 Mustang, and this one's funny. <laughs> um, when you guys buy this, check out the license plate and just Google white Mustangs. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to show you guys some stuff that we have for 2018 as well. And the first one, I'm sure you guys have seen it by now. Japan Historics 2. So we're doing uh, another 510, and 
has kind of like a tone on tone with the uh, BRE stripes on there. And uh, yes, very stoked about this. And one thing about our 2018 line is you're going to get full wrap decos. So you're going to get headlights, you're going to get tail lights, you're going to get everything. Plus a bigger car, yes. Plus a price increase. But it actually justifies more deco and it gives us more variety of castings that we can use later on. So yeah, RX3 anyway? I know Mark likes these. Alright. And another Z. And this one has a newly designed uh, front loop there. Uh, chin spoiler and the laurel in a very beautiful jade metallic. <laughs> and of course, the Skyline C210. Now I'm going to have Julian really quick talk about these awesome packages. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so of course you guys are all familiar with the original Japan stories. So the deal here was to try and follow it up with uh, something different, but just as strong. Um, one of the things I wanted to do this time around was make the packaging a little more dynamic, so I gave more energy to the vehicles. Um, it's more patterned after sort of more contemporary modern uh, art style. I mean, it still has a lot of Japanese influence, it's more based on like Japanese comics, manga, or uh, video games this time around just to bring uh, more, more energy to the, to the packaging. Um, that's pretty much it. Thank you, Julie. Yeah. 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 All right, so our second mix is Cargo Paradise. Actually, we have that on the board too, so you guys want to check that out later. We also have this photo on Odyssey. <laughs> and that was a, it's a new tool for premium because we did the diecast chassis conversion and we also added the uh, the rack <laughs> homage to like the old DTM racing livery, so I, I just love how this uh, model came out. So. Next one is a new tool. The LRA And this one will also be in Project Cars 2. And one more is the M1 Pro Car. Another Project Cars 2 appearance. You guys don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So for 2018, we're actually doing a different form factor for our premium lines. We call it Team Transport. It's pretty sweet. And I'll just show you it. ones are going to be available in fall of 2018. Everywhere. Anybody that wants to carry it, including Kmart. 
And we'll have six, uh, five different um, haulers. So it's, it'll essentially be a two pack for 2018. You're going to essentially get a car culture car and a hauler. What's and the, the cool thing is, each of these haulers they match a different theme of uh, car culture for the whole year. What's the price point? The, oh, oh, This will match the uh, Eurospeed collection because you have to apportion 962. These will be uh, $13. Hey, you're getting two premium dollars. And, and our wonderful designer, Mark Jones, he designed all of these. Um, and so he's been working on all these transformers. So expect them in fall of 2018. All right. So let's see some of our HWC items and RLC items. First is our custom Eldorado. And this will be released as one of the original 16 cars in the black boxes. I like it. right now, what we showed last year, you guys might be seeing a really big Sweet 16 set towards the end of the year. So these are some of the decks that we have. They look like our regular neoclassic wheels, but these are actually a neoclassic hub with a real right. First one is our collector case right here. No one likes that. And this will actually come with the 83 Silverado exclusive deco that you can't get anywhere else. The cool thing about these cases is they stand. But you can also hang them on the wall, as you can see here. The man caves. Man caves. Right! I bet it'll be 50 bucks. It's right here, right? I don't know. This one. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
All right. So for Target, we're doing a decades assortment, and this is uh, the one from the 80s in Monte Carlo, and Julian actually did the packaging for this, so it's pretty cool. Nice green tea. And we also have a Dodge Challenger and a Star size the same as pop culture and car culture. It'll, it'll be a brand new set of 10 different cars. There'll be two mixes, five cars each. And uh, this is just a sneak peek of one of them. And I also have a sneak peek of another one. Oh, so okay. one named C. And for Walmart specifically, we're going to do a whole thing assortment with Zamek Flames. Nice. So this will be an eight car assortment, um, available exclusively at Walmart, one dollar. One dollar. Woo! And I also got a deal for you to show you guys the Zamek Flames. So, for every other store besides our main ones, besides Walmart, Target, Toys R Us, we're doing a black and gold team store. And this one is the bone shaker. So, a dollar. <laughs> and this will be a six car assortment, and there will be a chase car. That's all the way to But you'll have to find out what it is like. And we're also doing, of course, our twin mill. And this will be a metal metal one. Three of both every now and then. Alright. So now I know we do a lot of, um, we do a lot of sweet 16 cars, original 16 cars in RLC, but we don't really do it in mainline. So, to end it, we are actually doing five different cars inspired from our original 16 collection, and these will be available at all retailers. <laughs> five bucks. And you get the button, you get the classic package, and you have, of course, your Camaro, your Mustang, Cougar, Beetle, and uh, Cougar. Alright, that is what we have to show you guys.